Happy Friday everyone and welcome back to Unbound Learners Pre-K. Let's begin our circle time with a good morning song. Stretch your arms out in front like a circle like this. Raise them up high then back out in front of you. Let's sing together. Good morning dear earth. Good morning dear sun. Good morning dear rocks and flowers everyone. Good morning dear beast and birds in the trees. Good morning to you and good morning to me. How are you all feeling today? Oh, that's so nice to hear. Let's move on to our calendar and mother chart behind me. Let's start with the month up here. Do you know what the month is? J, J, January. And today is January 8th. So let's move our chip from yesterday, which was the 7th, one over to today, which is the 8th. And we can say that today is January 8th and the year is 2021. Are you ready to count all the days that we've had in the month so far? Let me see those counting fingers. All right, here we go. We start up here at number one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Today is January 8th, 2021. It's time to sing the Days of the Week song, so I need to see those seven fingers because there's seven days in our week. Are you ready to go? There are seven days, there are seven days, there are seven days in a week. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So let's check down here. Do you remember what the day was yesterday? I'll give you a hint. Th th Thursday, you're right. Yesterday was Thursday. That means that today is Friday and tomorrow will be Saturday. Excellent job, friends. But today is Friday. Will you sing that with me? Today is Friday, today is Friday, today is Friday all day long. Today is Friday, today is Friday, today is Friday all day long. Now if I move up here, I have the season. The season is winter. And now it's time to sing our weather song. What's the weather? What's the weather? Can you tell? Can you tell? Is the sun shining? Is the rain falling? Can you tell? Can you tell? At my house, I have a cloudy, cloudy day. I don't see the sun shining. The sky is all gray and white. And the temperature is very, very cold. What's the weather like where you live? Are you ready to talk about this letter for the last time? Let's start off with this letter sound. What sound does this letter say? All right, let's make that sound together. And what is this letter called? Excellent work, friends. This is the letter S. S says S. Let's check what's in my number and letter box. I hear something rolling around. I wonder what it could be. Oh, ooh. All right, here's your first clue. This is a type of fruit. And this fruit is very sweet and juicy, and it's the color red. Do you know what's inside? Can you see what I have? It's a strawberry. Strawberry starts with the letter S. It's 
also the last day to talk about this number. Do you remember what number this is? The number five. And let's see those five fingers. And let's, let's count them. One, two, three, four, five. I have five fingers on one hand. The number five. Hmm. All right. You ready to do some more counting? I have five acorn tops inside of the box. Now that's getting to be quite a lot, so I'm going to line them up like this and we can count them together. Are you ready? One, two, three, four, five. Five acorn tops. Because today is Friday, that means that it's the last day that we'll be talking about land transportation. And I wanted to end the week talking all about trucks because there are so many different types of trucks. Now, some trucks are smaller like this. This is called a pickup truck. But other trucks are big, like this dump truck. Where would I find a dump truck like this? That's right, I would find this on a construction site. Now even though this truck is big and this truck is smaller, they have something in common. They both have beds. Now this bed is not the kind that you sleep on. This bed is in the back, right here. And it's used for picking up and hauling different loads. So what do you think that I could fit in the bed of this smaller pickup truck. Maybe I could pick up some boxes to transport them from here to there. And what would I find in the bed of this big dump truck? Ooh, gravel, you're right. What about a lot, a lot of dirt? A lot of diggers will scoop up dirt at a construction site and drop it into the bed of a dump truck and then the dump truck will carry it away to a different spot. My favorite type of truck is definitely a recycling truck because a recycling truck picks up trash like plastic and cardboard and glass and takes it to a recycling station where those items will be made into something new. It's so cool. Speaking of recycling, are you ready to see your work for the day? All right, let's check it out. For today's work, you're going to need a paper bag or some newspaper, and any type of basket or bowl. Now what you're going to do is, you're going to take the paper that you have, rip it up, you hear that sound? Crumble it up like this into a ball. Let's do a couple more. Rip it. And crumble, crumble, crumble. One more piece. Oh, that one's pretty small. Crumble it into a ball. And once you have your balls of paper, we're going to fill up the recycling truck. Now this is a tossing game. So I'm going to take my balls of paper and try to toss it into my recycling truck over here. There I go. Oh, I got it in. Got it in again. Let's see if I can make this smaller one. I did it. So you can use all the paper you want to fill up your recycling truck right there. But once you're done with the game, make sure that you use your paper and recycle it again or reuse it. I'm going to reuse this paper by smoothing it back out and I can use it for wrapping presents later. Let's get back to circle time. Welcome back friends. Thanks for learning all about land transportation with me. Join me on Monday as we continue our unit on transportation. We'll begin a new week with ways to travel on the water. Make sure to subscribe to my channel and check me out on outschool.com for live and interactive classes. We have one more song left to sing before we go. Wave goodbye like this. 
Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. I'll see you next time. Have a great weekend and I'll see you on Monday.